The homeland of the Vikings, a country with captivating landscapes, a rich history, and a deep culture, Norway. Number one, Alisund. This is a magnificent town located on the Northern Atlantic coast and serves as an excellent starting point for observing the Northern Lights. If you wanna see a breathtaking landscape, Axela Mountain, located behind the city center, offers a stunning view. This place provides a wonderful vantage point to see Alisund and its surroundings. Climbing up here, especially at sunset, will be a beautiful experience. If you're looking to have some fun, you can camp and go fishing while watching the Northern Lights. Alisun's history, cultural diversity, and natural beauty make it a captivating city. Number two, Oslo. Oslo is the capital and largest city of Norway, holding significant cultural, historical, and tourist importance for the country. This city is known for its port and impressive historic buildings lining its streets. One of the iconic attractions in Oslo is the Vigeland Sculpture Park, a vast outdoor sculpture park featuring approximately 200 sculptures that depict Norwegian culture and human relationships. The park's most striking feature is the numerous granite and bronze sculptures portraying human figures. It is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Oslo. As you stroll along the Oslofjord shores, you may come across a remarkable structure, likely the Oslo Opera House. The exterior of the building is covered with large white marble panels and it offers panoramic views of Oslo through pedestrian ramps on the top. It's a popular tourist spot for both art enthusiasts and architecture lovers. Just behind the Opera House, you'll find another notable structure, the Munch Museum. This museum houses the works of Norwegian painter Edvard Munch, including the famous painting The Scream, it provides an excellent opportunity to get a closer look at and understand Edvard Munch's emotional and symbolic artworks. Oslo is a perfect city to explore Norwegian history, and it's a must visit when you come to Norway. Number three, Orlandsfjord. Orlandsfjord is a fjord located in the west of Norway, serving as a branch of the Sognefjord. This magnificent place is surrounded by high mountains, lush valleys, and waterfalls. From the peaks of Orlandsfjord, or from viewpoints, you can capture breathtaking views. Additionally, boat tours are organized here, allowing you to get up close and personal with the fjord's beauty. It's possible to reach Orlandsfjord from Norway's capital, Oslo, by car in approximately five hours or by plane in just 50 minutes. Number four, Bergen. Bergen is Norway's second largest city and an impressive port city located on the western coast. When visiting Bergen, the first things that will leave an impression on you are the wooden, colorful houses and narrow streets of Bergen. 
These houses stand on stilts along the coast. This is one of Norway's most iconic sites and has a long history dating back to the Middle Ages. This historic area is listed on the UNESCO World Heritage List. If you want to admire the city from a distance, you can take the Floyabenen funicular to Mount Floyen to enjoy the cityscape. While you're here, don't forget to enjoy the natural beauty of fjords, mountains, and waterfalls. Number five, Flam. Flam is a village located in the Flamsdalen Valley at the inner end of the Orlandsfjord, a branch of the Sognefjord. It is renowned for its breathtaking natural beauty, fjords, and mountains. Moreover, Flam serves as the starting point for one of Norway's most popular train journeys, the Flam Railway. During the train journey, you have the opportunity to witness magnificent natural wonders, such as waterfalls, valleys, and farms. Flam is also a popular hub for outdoor activities in its surrounding natural environment. Here you can engage in outdoor activities like trekking, biking, canoeing, and fishing. This destination will truly be impressive for a tour of Norway. While in Norway, don't forget to visit the Drakkar wooden sculpture located on this desolate rock on Vardu Island. It was constructed in the summer of 2016 by the Tybola Assemble team from Arkhangelsk Severodvinsk. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to stay tuned for more.